All right, for our next community conversation, we are joined by Judy Wood, program leader at the center. She's sitting down with Steve. Hey there, Steve. All right, Casey, thank you. We're doing TV, but for the next few minutes, let's focus on the book. And um, the center getting involved with this year's festival of the book, which is exciting. Um, how is the center going to be participating? Well, on Thursday, the center will be hosting a book discussion. Okay. Thursday at 4 p.m. Um, the African American Authors Book Club has invited or is hosting an author for the book festival this year. So the center will host, will, will provide their setting, and uh, Rosalind Story is the author who will be in the book discussion with us this year. And we're very excited. Uh, she's an awesome author, but she's also a violinist. And so the center is providing the place for us to oh. have the book discussion How on fantastic Thursday. That is, and you brought a copy of the book, which we'll, yes. we can let people take a look at. Tell us about the book. Well, the book is a story of two vocally talented women whose lives crossed all boundaries. And story has weaved together uh, a story of these two ladies uh, that is so fascinating and so inspiring. So I would encourage you, if you have not obtained the book yet, to absolutely get it. But also to attend the discussion on Thursday uh, because we we'll learn a lot about the author, but also about the book and different things the author has done, the story has done over her life to um, educate us and to inspire us about how black music has been so intricate in music in, in America. And obviously she has an interest in music. If she, I wonder if she'll be able to read and play violin at the same time, perhaps? Well, we, <laughs> she may, she could do that. Uh, but she will, uh, on Thursday, have a presentation that's a little bit different in the beginning, and I would encourage, I won't tell you what that is, but I would encourage you to come and see what it is. But uh, it's gonna be an, a wonderful time. And I would just, particularly um, high school students who are interested in music and in, in, uh, violin or string music, be a good time to come and hear. Spectacular. We talk about the partnerships, and the center does so much with the community, not just with the festival of the book, but why are these partnerships with the community so important to the center? It just brings people in the community uh, to the center for all different kinds of things. There are all different kinds of exercises and um, we do partner, the center does partner with AARP and uh, JABA and uh, different others. So it's a good place to come uh, if you're senior, but also if you want to be a senior one day. You want to get there. <laughs> want to get there with the exercises and interacting with each other and we have uh, line dancing and exercises and uh, storytelling and day trips and all kinds of things so I would just encourage you to come. Tuesday is when you can come and and get a tour of the center between 10 and 11. Great. So. We encourage people to get out there, check out the center in general, check out its partnership with the Festival of the Book. Mm -hmm. Appreciate you coming in today. Thanks. So glad you had me come. Thank All you for having right. me. All right. Casey?